can I have some money? You're welcome. I can't hear again, huh? Yes. I know. It's kind of goofy, right? <laughs> no. I don't think so. I mean, you do got a washer and dryer at home now. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> you can't keep doing this. He just keeps wanting to come up here. Yeah, you wanna come up here and play them video games? Uh, like father, like son, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. He doesn't really talk anymore, and I'm not sure if he's like still trying to process everything or. Yeah, if he's probably coping. He's six B. He shouldn't have to cope. Like he should be worried about the next Marvel toy or going to Chuck E. Cheese or I don't know. I'm sorry. Don't apologize. It's just that nobody could have known that we get caught up. I just feel like I, I should have did more. Like I could have did more. You were such a good man. It's like everything, it just happens so fast. Man, fuck you! I ain't doing shit! I told you that wasn't me! I just got off work. I'm here with my family trying to wash my fucking laundry. I need you to calm down. No! You pointing a fucking gun at me! You gonna shoot me in front of my wife, in front of my kid? Do you have a weapon on you? Hey! Do you have a weapon on you? Yeah. You see where I stay. Are you right-handed or left-handed? Right. Okay. I'm gonna need you to remove your weapon with your left hand slowly. Everything's gonna be all right. I think about that night and those final moments like all the time. Here go one. Sir, I need you to look forward. You never forget the smell of gun smoke. That's facts. You laughing at? <laughs> Remember that time we went to DQ and Lil V dropped his chocolate cone on your new white shoes? Man. Uh, 
That sound you made, though. <laughs> That was so embarrassing. <laughs> like, <laughs> my grandpa used to make that noise. I'm just. <laughs> I used some extra that. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> so how is it? How's what? No. Yeah. Right. Um. Yeah, it's, uh, it's good. Mm. It's a lot of work. Yeah, it's a, it's a lot of good work. <laughs> it's good. So what's the plan? I just gotta do everything that I can to get him back to his normal life. Basketball? Education. <laughs> <laughs> and then basketball or whatever else will help him. Because we want him to be his own person, right? Right, 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 right. Or the next Kobe, right? <laughs> 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 I can do this without you. I don't know why I have to do this without you. And I don't know if I can, because I want so much for our son that it hurts me to even think about like everything that he has to overcome and look past and fight for. I don't know if I can do anything to protect him. You got support. You got family. You got friends. You even got the settlement. I only got that settlement because this place has cameras that work with decent audio. And they still try to lie on you, B. Try to paint you as some monster just because you had a gun? Like, because black people can't have guns, I guess. You know how hard it was for me to sit in front of those animals and just listen to them and watch them, and it was... Shh, 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 shh. I'm here. I'm right here. I just really, I just really miss you so much. I'm right here with you. I ain't going nowhere. I would give it all back just to have you back really here with us. No, no, listen. No, you take the money and you give our son everything that we never had. You teach him everything that you possibly can and a little more. You can do this. I love you, D. My son, my beautiful black prince, as I nurture you into the king you are to be, you are no monster or thing. You are the future of this corrupted world and a silent, swift solution to a movement untelevised. I swear to protect you from all the wolves at our door and all the snakes in our garden, to show you what black pride really means, instilling insight and knowledge in all things, because that's what black power really means. 
igniting in you the heritage in your DNA. So when a bigot approaches you, and they will approach you, you will have everything to say, whether it's from your mouth or with your fist. The message is the same. You matter. <laughs>